Welcome to the VPG video series covering the installation of the Truckway system. In this video we will cover the process of installing an axle transducer on a bogey. Please refer to the appropriate video when installing axle transducers on steel spring or strut suspension systems. Axle transducers measure small changes in the angle of deflection on the suspension to calculate the weight that has been applied. Please note the guidance in this video is related to the guidance in the Truckway manual. The following parts are used when you install an axle transducer. The transducer, VHB bonding tape, alcohol wipes. You will also need the following tools, scotch bright, brake cleaner and a G-clamp. An angle grinder equipped with a general purpose sanding flat disc may be required to clean heavy dirt and debris on the mounting location. And if you are fitting the transducer in cold weather, you may also need a hot air gun. Before you start installing an axle transducer, ensure you have all the necessary components and tools for the job. You will also need to make notes about the transducers and where they are positioned as this is important when you come to configuring the system. It is recommended that you use a system configuration table in the Truckway manual to record this information. The first step of the installation procedure is to find where you will fit the transducer. This should be placed below the spring in a location that is flat as possible. It should be placed as close as possible to an axle, but where there is no risk of damage from any moving parts on the vehicle. Also, you should make sure that the cable can be routed to the junction box without risk of damage. When you fit the axle's transducer, it must be in the correct orientation. The transducer must be placed in a position that is parallel with the chassis of the vehicle, either facing forward or backwards. The transducer is also marked with a groove around one edge. This must always be facing up. Finally, a cable runs out of the rear of the transducer. This must always run away from the closest axle. First, the mounting surfaces must be prepared. Remove any dirt and debris at the position where you want to mount the transducer. Use Scotch-Brite and brake cleaner to clean the surfaces down to bare metal. Use alcohol wipes to finish cleaning the area and allow enough time for the cleaner to evaporate. Next, use the alcohol wipes to clean the mounting surface of the transducer. Once dry, apply the VHB bonding tape. The ideal temperature to help the tape to bond to the metal surface is 15 degrees centigrade, 60 degrees Fahrenheit. If necessary, use the heat gun to heat the spring before mounting the transducer. Remove the protective strip from the VHB tape and fix the transducer on the spring in the correct orientation. Use a G-clamp to secure it in place and leave it attached for at least 5 minutes. This concludes the video guidance for how to install an axle transducer. Further guidance on this procedure can be found in the manual. You can find more information on installing the other parts of the truckway system on our YouTube channel or by visiting our website.